Alright, hello everyone, it's Sea Dog here, and we are back with another video too. Day. And we got some good old fashioned Fortnite gameplay for you know, a usual on my channel. But for this video, we're gonna be doing something a little bit different than you know, the usuals. We will not be doing Team Rumble. Oh, no, no, no. We shall be doing. Da -na 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 -na. One shot! Yay, one shot! Uh, I said this in another video, I want to do some one shot because I do like sniping in games. I think it's really fun, you know, change of pace just using snipers. So we're gonna be doing some one shot. And actually, we're not going to be doing one shot because I've already done one shot. Uh, as you can tell right here in my replays mode, we're going to be not doing a live gameplay. We're just going to be, you know, going to my replays and, you know, just kind of commentating over one of my latest games that I had in one shot. And as you can see right here, we have a gem of a game. We got the dub, guys, in one shot. Very hype about that. And, you know, since we did, of course, get the dub, that only means one thing. Ladies and gentlemen... We got him. We did it, guys. We got the Season 9 Glider slash Umbrella, the Victory Royale for Season 9. Uh, I don't know why it doesn't say uh, Season 9 or whatever for right here. It just says Neo Tilted's Finest. But nevertheless, again, you guys, really cool Umbrella. Just, I think, again, just with the seasons, you know, keep on going and going. It The gliders, I think, or gliders, but the gliders too. But, you know, the umbrellas are just getting a lot better and cooler. Uh, you know, of course, you got Season 9. Or not season nine, season seven, you know, with the whole snowman and, you know, the carrot top thing. And then, you know, season eight with the whole palm leaves and then the actual, like, handle thing, like a wooden, you know, stick, whatever. And then, you know, of course, you know, you got season six with the spider web and whatever. But nevertheless, again, I think, you know, with the seasons continuing, it's just going to get a lot more crazier and all that stuff. But I would say this is probably my third favorite. Again, I just really like the season eight and the season seven. I just think these are like the best umbrellas that they've had so far. But again, this is probably again my third favorite, I'd say. Again, blue is my favorite color, so I do like that. But again, it's a hologram, and usually holograms are blue for the most part. But nevertheless, again, you can also kind of see where the like umbrella top part meets the uh, handle. You can kind of see that's invisible. Kind of a good shot right here. It'll move. Nevertheless, guys, I'm going to be rambling on for too long. So I guess we're going to briefly just mention one more thing. It is almost week two. So got to, you know, get my XP and all that stuff for getting the challenges. Because as you can see here, we are almost close to the level 54 to get the Afterburner song. And I'm very hyped about this. Again, this is like probably one of my favorite things on the Battle Pass. But nevertheless, guys, I think it is time to get into the video. Because if we don't, I'm just going to be rambling on like I am right now. But I shall see you all. When the game starts. Alright guys, and now we are back. And I'll just, you know, briefly say it's been a minute since I've done one of these. So, don't really know if I'm going to have a lot of jump cuts or what to even talk about. I guess we, you know, will MLG commentate over it. As we have Sea Dog gliding in. No one else is on him. Except for a bunch of people going to the old Greasy Grove. One person is at Polar Peaks. Two people are at Polar Peaks, actually. So, pretty much again. So, my teammate wanted to go Polar Peaks. I wanted to go Racetrack. Because, you know, I always go Racetrack. But then, nevertheless, he went to Polar Peak, so I just thought, you know, I'll just go with him and, you know, just play as a team because I want to get the dub. But, you know, two games isn't a lot, but as you already saw, you know, with my replays and all that stuff, I was in second place for the game before this, so I really want to get the dub. So, I didn't really care. I just went with him, and luckily I did because no one went Polar Peaks. I'm super surprised about that. But again, right now, as far as what we're doing, I'm pretty much just looting up. Again, I think... I'm just kind of making sure that no one's around. I am hearing a bunch of noise, but again, that's my teammate. And then on the map, one thing I do like about replay mode is you can see where like the enemies are at, which is really cool because it's like you wouldn't know where they're at before. And it's like they can be so close, but then you have no clue that they were that close because just you're not looking in the right place. I don't know, but that's really cool. So as you can see, I am just gliding around still trying to look for some loot. Again, some shadow bombs. The shadow bombs do come in clutch for this uh, game mode, I would say. Oh, yeah, that's definitely not my teammate. So, yeah, some some random dude just literally hoverboards up to Polar Peaks. I don't know what he was doing. He was clearly a default with the whatever skin, but I don't know what he's doing. He was just, he was not trying to win. He was not trying to win at all, but got the easy kill off of him. So, we already got one elimination, guys. You know, that's always a good shout for the beginning. And again, I see a chest right there, so I'm going to go loot it up. Alright, now my teammate is actually about to port a rift, or about to rift, 
Uh, I don't know why he was, you know, building all around him. I guess maybe so that way enemies can't use it or, you know, see where we're at. But nevertheless, I am trying to go. I believe I was trying to go fatal to where that little sky ship base thing is at. But he was going shifty. I have no clue why he was going shifty. That wasn't even in the circle. But maybe he was trying to get some more loot. Maybe he didn't have, you know, good snipers or hunting rifles. But I'm just trying to, you know, get to the circle. Because, again, I just want to, you know, get to the circle, find a place to camp. And just, you know, try to get the dub. As you can see on the mini-map now, there's actually two people in front of me. And again, you know, just wasting all those uh, smoke bombs. And then I see him on the map, so I point them out. I don't actually use the, you know, red... Uh, oh, there's an enemy alert. I just kind of make a waypoint. So my teammate sees that he starts, you know, gliding over here, whatever he's doing. I'm just, you know, trying to keep an eye on them to see where they're at. Just so that way I don't lose track of them and, you know, they don't just, like, snipe me from the back. As you can already tell right here, there's actually someone right behind me. And I didn't know this at the time. I'm, you know, trying to focus to see where all the enemies are at that were right in front of me. But then that dude right behind me snipes me. And I actually do want to... Oh, dang. My teammate eliminated, eliminated him fast, Jeebus. There he is. Look at him just chilling. Trying to get an easy shot. Oh, nice. My teammate got him out of the air. Jeebus. Uh, anyway, so pretty much what I'm doing now is I'm marking on the map at Fatal because there's that respawn bus. So I'm hoping that he can, you know, have me respawn because I want to get the dub. And, you know, two people are always better than one. So nevertheless, he is actually going to the respawn bus. So that's always a good shout. And also, you know, leave feedback in the comments. You know what I should be doing for these, you know, types of videos. Don't really do them too much. I usually do live gameplays and all that stuff. So I don't know if I should be cutting out a lot or whatever. But nevertheless, again, he is a homie because he is actually responding or getting me to respond. So always a good shout. And he's doing it while he's in the storm. Uh, again, I think the storm is only one tick. Maybe two. Only have a green uh, hunting rifle, which is not a good shout. Especially when, again, you have two people over there. But then my teammate gets the uh, rift, so I pretty much try to go to the old place where I, you know, got eliminated at. To see if I can, you know, pick up my old loot, but I guess my teammate might have already done that. And then, you know, I see some bandages here, smoke grenades and all that stuff. So try to go pick those up. I'm pretty sure they're not called smoke grenades, too. Just as an FYI, probably saying that wrong, but it is what it is. And then, yikes, my teammate got sniped. And then right now, I am I just I want to respond or get him to respawn so that way you know we, I have two people because again I'm not the best with the snipers, but then again you know I you know have my moments so again you know just rift try to rift out of there and then also you know I'm in the storm so that's always not a good shot but he's like spamming the respawn van I think at salty maybe, but luckily we didn't go salty because there's two dudes on us and then two dudes already at salty so I'm going to the mega mall because at this point in the game. You know, there might be a team there, but as long as you know I can kind of sneak my way in, they won't notice me. And there's actually, the dude's still following me, Jeebus. That man was on my tail. Maybe they lost, uh, you know, interest and just ignored me. Oh yeah, so no, that dude definitely popped shots off at me. And then placed a trap down just in case. But it looks like we are all clear as far as the minimap goes. No one's really inside except for that dude who's already in the circle, but he's way up there. He's not even looking at the Mega Mall. And we got our teammate back in the game, so that's always a good shout. And then he's, yeah, I think he's saying the ammo thing emote. Yeah, he's saying the ammo emote, and I'm just, you know, deploying ammo right there while people are just popping shots off at us. Got to love it. 16 people left with one elimination. You gotta love it. And then my teammate has got two, so it's always good. And I saw that there was a bush literally just jumping around, so I was just, you know, trying to pop some shots off at just random bushes just in case if he was there. But it looks like he is right to the right of us. Probably smart that I didn't get the, you know, the supply drop because I already had a gold sniper. And I think I had a blue hunting, so I was already loaded up. Is the enemy even spawning in? Oh, okay. I was like, what am I shooting at over there? Oh, yeah, there he is. So, again, just, you know, picking some shots off. See if we can get the elimination. And then now we are getting to almost the final ring. This is what I definitely want to see because this is where like everyone is at. 
and it's all like around the mountain so definitely want to see where everyone was at originally because me and my teammate just literally made this our own base like we were literally eliminating people left and right from here so this was our sky base there was some dude originally up on there and we were like oh no no no, no. this is ours now dang also in replay mode makes it this makes me look really bad that shot was definitely a lot closer play mode is making my shots look bad oh yikes I mean, maybe they originally were, but in the game, but they definitely weren't that bad. But yeah, it is definitely a busy area right now with the circle being so small. And the panda had no chance. Snoiped him in the foot. Gotta love it. Shout out to the uh, panda skin. They're actually making a Funko Pop of the panda skin. Gonna have to, you know, cop that. Bruh, the... The markers keep throwing me off because I think the white one's me. But yeah, no, also, just being up here was also, like, really, like, I kept, like, looking back left and right just to see where everyone was at because I always heard, it, like, a glider noise. So I always thought people were, like, gliding up to us and stuff. But I got finished right there from the little wind turbine thingy. You know, it pushed me off. And I think my teammate saw that, so I think he came down and also helped out. Oh, yeah, that was a bit of lag. Or actually, so my teammate is actually not even by me. So I get that dude. So we got, or actually we got three eliminations now. Forgot the other one on top of there. And then we got ourselves the 4th of July cuddle team leader. And I was just saying, you know, screw it. I'm not even going to bother. But then I see my teammate flying down. So I was like, oh, well, might as well, you know, go help him out. So I'm now sky high in the air. And hoping that my teammate doesn't get eliminated somehow because that would be no good because I do not think that there's any respawn vans around here. There might be one inside of the mountain, but... Or the volcano. And then we get that. We got the fourth elimination, guys. Got you. Love it. A1 gameplay. You know, we are just eliminating people left and right. And now there's literally five people left. Or three three people because there's two of us so this is when i'm just like bro i just i really want to get the dub there's literally three people left so there's either three just solos or there's you know one team one solo so we pretty much have this in the bag like the odds are in our favor so making sure no one's camping in there and then we got just one dude over there just, you know, wanted to pop off just a lucky shot to see maybe if I can get lucky and, you know, hit him. But nevertheless, we were not too lucky. And it looks like there's some dude underneath us and then some dude at the actual pressure plant. Uh, I have no clue what that dude below us is doing. That is, that is funny. I actually did not know. I thought they were both over there, like, during the circle. So I thought there was one dude right there and then one dude in, like, another building. But I guess he was underneath us, so... Gotta love that. Again, replay mode is always cool. I really like it. This is really cool to see, like, where everyone's at and all. Okay, so that's when the other dude actually makes his way into the, uh, volcano. Nice. And then I was, you know, gonna try to get a lucky shot off on him, but then, you know, he was able to rift away just in time. Actually, I'm not gonna eliminate him because I only have four eliminations this game. But again, this is one th reason why I do like the shadow bombs or whatever is because, again, you can, you know, jump out on top of those, like, sky bases or whatever, but... Nevertheless, now we're getting into the end of the game, the end game, guys. And then this is just a complete, like, there's there's an enemy right there. I mean, you already know. And, again, I don't know what he's doing. Again, I know people build the little bases and, you know, they edit. And then they get the easy shot, but then... It's... I thought I literally had him. I swear I had him. But, nevertheless, he, he did get the best of me, not gonna lie. But, it is what it is. And then, as we can get out of here, my teammate just eliminated one more guy. So, then we just have that one dude who's already eliminated me. And, just because I didn't want to, like, throw him off or, you know, distract him. I didn't, you know, mark or anything. Because, also, one, my tag was already there. So, we knew that the enemy was probably gonna be over there. So, you know, I was kind of just hoping he'd, you know, do his own thing. And I didn't want to distract him. Got my dude over here, you know, he got the enemy over there just building away. He's pretty much doing the exact same strategy he did against me, just barricading himself in and then, you know, building the stairs so that way, you know, he can edit it and then get a quick snipe. But it looks like my teammate was doing pretty good to counter that. 
you know, with the bolt, or not the bolt, the uh, Barret. And he snipes that, and then bam, gets the old switcheroo. And then that's it, guys. That's how we got the dub. So again, four eliminations for me, and then I believe four eliminations for my teammate. Uh, I don't know why I can't move that. Very happy about this. Again, he got my first dub of the season. Or not my first dub of the season, but, you know, my first win of the game or the season to give me the umbrella. But nevertheless, guys, that is going to do it for the video for today. Again, you know, a little change of pace, you know, with the whole not live gameplay and, you know, the one shot game mode gameplay instead of Team Rumble. So, again, always a good change of pace. And then again, also, you know, you can let me know some feedback for these type of videos. Again, I usually do them live. So, you know, I can kind of, I would say maybe talk more about certain stuff. I don't know. But nevertheless, again, very happy that I got the umbrella. Again, you know, I could have gotten it in solos, duos, squads, whatever. I mean, I couldn't but i could i don't know but again regardless i got the umbrella which is what matters at the end of the day as long as i got it i'm happy with that because that's all that matters and also you know getting up to level 100 on the season 9 battle pass but nevertheless guys that is going to do it for the video again if you enjoyed leave a like subscribe leave feedback in the comments again my emote locker is not letting me dance but nevertheless guys thank you for watching and have a good day